what we're looking at here is a circular box made of gold set with two mid-17th century portrait enamels of Louis XIV. There's further decoration on the box. What we have is the fleur-de-lis, symbols of the Bourbon dynasty, little sprigs of laurel leaves and white opaque pearls surrounding the outside. Gold boxes were the ultimate fashion accessory in the 18th century and a little into the 19th century. Here at the Wallace we have a small but very fine collection of 99 gold boxes. The enamel portrait miniatures set within this box were not made at the same time as the box. The portrait miniatures date from the mid 17th century and the box dates to the 19th century. We know that the portrait miniatures were by an artist called Jean Petitot, who was a specialist in miniature portraits. It is likely that the portrait miniatures have been reused from something called a boîte portrait. A boîte portrait was a little jewel encrusted medallion or pendant set with Louis XIV's miniature in the middle and surrounded by diamonds or other semi-precious stones. The box itself was made in the 19th century and we know that it was made by Parisian goldsmith Nicolas Huguet. He ceased working in 1816. It is highly unlikely then that a gold box which celebrates France's greatest monarch, Louis the Sun King, would have been made during the reign of Napoleon. Therefore, we can safely assume that this box was made post fall of Napoleon in 1814 and 1816 when the goldsmith ceases to work. The history and the context of the time is one of political turmoil and uncertainty. France has undergone a revolution. It's been ruled by a leader who's taken them into battle and has ultimately lost Napoleon. Therefore, it's hardly surprising that the aristocracy of France are welcoming back the return of the Bourbon dynasty and harking back to a time when France was strong and the monarchy was secure. And ultimately, this box is celebrating the return of the monarchy and Louis XIV in particular.